no more excuses. Showrunner Shonda Rhimes told a crowd of fired-up young women that they need to be a citizen at the Los Angeles when we all vote rally. Listen to what she wants us to do before the November 6 midterms. Grace Anatomy and scandal creator Shonda Rhimes, 48, isn't taking age for an excuse. Her message echoed in the immense USC Galen Center in Los Angeles on September 28. Young women can be trailblazers in the political arena. An excited crowd gathered for the event Shonda headlined on behalf of the When We All Vote Rally, a not-for-profit organization that aims to get people talking about voting, democracy, and their rights. Other big Hollywood figures have joined the not-for-profit's cause, and today, Shonda continued the conversation. Some people have ideas out there when it comes down to how women work and their ideas can suck it, Shonda said to a roaring crowd. Every election counts, we can't. It is quite clear, if you want your voice to be heard, if you want your face to be represented, then you have to get involved," Shonda later told the audience. She then revealed to America's future leaders how they can make changes now. You have to be a citizen, you have to vote," Shonda said. You do not want anyone else determining the course of your future. Shonda's inspiring words, intended to move the crowd to action ahead of the November 4 midterm elections, followed on the tale of former First Lady Michelle Obama's speech at the organization's Las Vegas rally on September 23. And we were also in attendance for that amazing event. The former floatist, who's now a co-chair of the When We All Vote rally along with Tom Hanks, Lynn manuel Miranda, Janelle Money, Chris Paul, Faith Hill, and Tim McGraw gave sad statistics on America's participation. In presidential elections, only about half of eligible people bother to vote. That's in a presidential election. In midterm elections, like the one coming up in November, when no one is running for president, the turnout is even lower, Michelle told the Las Vegas crowd. It's the truth. That's where we are. And right now, one in Keegan Michael Key also spoke at the rally along with the former first lady. You're allowed to complain if you do vote, but you can't complain about anything if you don't, Key told us on September 23. You get the leaders that you don't vote for if you live a life of bystanderism, you get what you deserve if you don't care about this very important part of the democratic process, then ever.